and this is the book of uh, this is the book of Matthew, chapter twenty-four, verse six, and it reads through the Holy Scriptures. And ye shall hear of wars and Romans of wars. See that you be not troubled, for all these things must first come to pass, but the end is not yet. Chapter one, first and foremost, I'd like to give all praises and glory and honor to to Yahweh Basha, Yahweh Shai, Bahasha, Rakarash. And the heavenly Father, true name is that Yahweh. His only begotten Son, Bahashim, in the name of Mashiach, Yahweh Shai. Those are the true names in the ancient Paleo people. And uh, Shalom to the uh, elders, and I say Shalom. And this is a uh, another sit down lesson that I want to bring out from the Jerusalem Post.com, published by uh, published November 15, 2023, and last updated November 15, 2023. And this was by T Z B I J O F F F R E from the Jerusalem Post.com, and it reads. It says, uh, over 20 rockets fired from Lebanon towards Israel. The IDF strikes Hezbollah. It says, Hezbollah claimed responsibility for a number of strikes along the Israeli-Lebanese border on Wednesday. It says, over 20 rockets were fired from Lebanon towards the Korolet Shimuna Moti Shimon. If I pronounced that right, in other areas along the Lebanese Israeli border on Wednesday, according to the IDF spokesperson unit, it says the Hezbollah took responsibility for the rocket fire towards the Kuwait Shimuna. It says the IDF responded to the rocket fire with the artillery fire targeting several sites in southern Lebanon, including a Hezbollah observation point. It says Hezbollah it additionally stated that. Target an IDF post along the border near the Mount Dove, uh, another post near near on um, another post in Mesa Al Jabal. If I pronounce, pronounce that right, and it says another post in the Ramaks and a an additional post near the Boston uh, Boston step on Wednesday afternoon and evening. But the IDF has not performed any reports of it yet. It says the Lebanese Foreign Minister Abdul. Paul Habal met with Iran ambassador on Wednesday. He walked Jamal the Mali on Wednesday telling him that Israel is not defending itself together, but rather is obsessed with blind revenge. This is the UNIVIL works to contain escalation. It says on Wednesday, the UNIVLE commander Orlando Rosario briefly represented representatives of the countries that provide troops for the peace making missions. What that scripture says, first Thessalonians 5 and verse 3, for when they shall say peace and safety come the southern stress component. Mentions about situations on the southern on the southern Lebanese border. It says on Tuesday, Lazaro met with Lebanese speaker of the Palmyra Mary, Nabal Iri, and caretaker of Prime Minister Najab. Abutai expressed his deep concern about the situation in southern Lebanon. And it says the UN, the UNIFIL's priorities right now are to prevent escalation, safeguard civilians' lives, and ensure the safety and secure of peacemakers who are trying to encompass. I don't see no peace, <laughs> peace at the moment right now. Escalations are continuing to rise between both both Hamas and uh, Israel. So. Ain't no peace at the moment, <laughs> you know. You know, I'm just saying it for instance, because the scripture came into mind in First Thessalonians 5 and verse 3. It says, Resolutions of the 701 is being challenged at the moment, but it is principles of security, stability, and for a long term uh, solution remains valid. But we'll see about that. But in the meantime, as it reads again, over 20 rockets fired from Lebanon towards Israel, IDF strikes Hezbollah. And this is the book of uh, Matthew, chapter 24, verse 6, and it reads the Holy Scriptures. And ye shall hear of wars and rumors of wars, see that you be not troubled for all these things must first come to pass, but the end is not yet. Matthew 24, and verse 7, and it reads, For nation shall rise against nation, and kingdom against kingdom. There shall be famines and pestilence and earthquakes in diverse places. So with that, hopefully this uh, sit-down lesson was edifying. Another sit-down lesson that I want to bring out. Uh, 
uh, from the Jerusalem Post, November 15, 2023, as it says once again, over 20 rockets fired from Lebanon towards Israel. The IDS reports as well as a Wednesday. So with that, let me give all praises and glory and honor to the Yahweh Hashem, Hashem, Karkadash, Shalom to the uh, elders, Wa'aki and Wa'akwa. Until next time, I will say Shalom.